Recently, I met up with my good friend, Grayson Hall. Grayson has been voted the best photographer in Morgantown, West Virginia for the past three years. Grayson needed some updated photos for not only his advertisements, but for his social media. So Grayson and I met down by the amphitheater near the Wharf District, and we started taking some photos. Here. Um, this is real, real professional photographers right here. <laughs> I don't know if the hand in the pocket's kind of natural for this. Maybe, maybe just like resting on your leg, not like on your cross, but like on your leg. Thank you for paying attention. Dude, that was a banger. It's like, oh, it's a, it's a mood. It's a look. I was like, let's not do that ball, dude. <laughs> Fifteen, seven fourteen. I'm pretty much up. You just want to run out the door. She's not. I think it'd be fun to fly up there. After we were done with the shoot, Grayson asked if I wanted to go up to Dorsey's Knob to test out his drone, the DJI Avada. <laughs> TV, but I was really excited to check it out in person for myself. Grayson has brought his DJI Avada. I'm about to take my first flight. Okay, so just don't push this. But yeah, just in normal, but it's still, even normal, it is extremely touchy. I, you're going to be fine, but I'm just saying, like, <laughs> like, you'll be surprised. Like, you know, just be very, like, don't just blast it because it is very, very touchy. He's handing the controllers over. <laughs> I don't even it's know. It's already recording, man, so I'm just gonna let it I don't even know what white balance I put that in. I didn't think about that, but it looks fine. I think I was filming outside last with it, so. Well, we'll see how this goes. Oh, shit. Yeah, just make sure you take it up a little bit. So it's, yeah. Oh my god, dude. This is fucking insane. You can give her some gas. It, it'll go pretty quick with that. As long as you're up above the trees. Oh shit, I did my first turn. There we go. Oh. Oh yeah, dude, this is sick. Oh, okay. So, like, if you turn 
like the right joystick. Like if you turn the joysticks like the same way, it turns a lot easier. Yeah, yeah, it's right. just like a normal drone. You fly a normal drone. You're just obviously you're gonna be a little more intuitive with your turning. It does bank too instead of be horse keep you horizontal. You know what I mean? Right. Take it all the way up to the rock. So the percentage for batteries in the lower right, correct? Yeah. Alright, cool. It's at 31. You're good then. It'll give you a kind of a return to home at like 10%, I think. But it goes pretty quick. Oh, those are very springy. I like how it has the H for home on here. Mm -hmm. Oh, dude, this is a beautiful shot. Holy fuck, dude, this is amazing. God damn it. <laughs> I know I'm gonna have to go out and spend like a thousand dollars now. You're gonna want one. I'd recommend this one over. I mean the other one's a little bit cheaper, but you can it just has the you know flying normally makes for that's easier footage. This manual is it's a then this thing goes it goes sixty in manual. It's like so touchy. I'm gonna bring it down through these trees. Sketchy, but I think I cleared it. I cleared it. How bad are you got? Uh, pretty good, actually. I'm gonna just bring it through this pole and around. <laughs> oh, I think I got this. Dude, I just drove through the uh, pavilion. Oh, wait, no, 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 ah! Hit, hit it. Yeah, there you go. It'll, it'll break for a second and bring it back. It's a dying. Uh, I, I guess so, yeah, 27%. Yeah, it's probably, yeah, that's probably what it was at BP Town. Okay. Return to home. So I'll just go ahead and bring it back. It says, oh, there it is, I can even see it. I think that's on the goggles. Oh, okay. They record the goggles and the, the uh... Oh yeah, it says an hour and 19 minutes. So oh. if you lose it, you kind of can look at the footage and figure out where you're at. <laughs> Now, luckily with the DJI Avada, there's many different settings, especially if you're a beginner and you're just learning FPV, there's different modes on the Avada to where you can set it and fly it like a normal drone and you can work your way up into full manual mode, which I was just no, no full manual mode for me. So my first thoughts is I absolutely love FPV and I might have to invest in a DJI Avada. After seeing the footage in the goggles and then getting it back and checking it out for myself, I'm absolutely blown away. Even as like a beginner, I thought it was very similar to flying a drone, but after testing it out in the simulator, I am nowhere near ready to try out full manual mode and I have total respect for anyone who flies FPV full manual because in the simulator, it was bad. It was just restart 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 that was terrible now i figured if i put in some hours and got some practice in i could probably get pretty good but watching grayson just zip around dorsey's knob and i don't know it was just like seeing him do it i was just like damn <laughs> and there's other fpv pilots out there who i've been watching for a while now and it seems like i was like oh you know this seems easy it's not it is it looks so complicated. The controls feel so complicated. 
If you would like me and Grayson to do a full video with the DJI Avada, just let us know in the comments below. I'd absolutely love to get back out there and do some flying with him. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. It helps push this video out to other people. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell so you know when I post new content, and I'll see you in the next video. Kind of choppy, and I got those extra propeller guard things on the guard, so it's like really a lot of.